before your operating system even thinks about loading, something else wakes up first. Hidden in the shadows of your machine is a tiny world. BIOS, UEFI, and firmware. The invisible puppeteers behind every boot, click, and command. Most users will never touch it. Most security tools won't even scan it. But elite hackers? They see it for what it really is, the ultimate backdoor. Welcome to Dark BIOS, the lowest layer of your system and the highest prize for any serious attacker. This isn't about malware you can uninstall. This is about rewriting the machine's DNA. Hackers embed rootkits directly into firmware, hijacking the boot sequence before antivirus even activates. Once they're in, they're in forever, immune to reinstalls, updates, or firewalls. We're talking about weaponized BIOS updates, rogue UEFI implants like Lojax, Intel ME hijacking, and firmware logic bombs triggered by keystrokes during boot. Imagine cleaning your entire system and still being infected because the malware lives beneath your hard drive, beyond your operating system, hiding in the motherboard silicon itself. These aren't sci-fi threats. They've been deployed in real-world espionage, silently sitting inside diplomatic laptops and mission-critical servers. Hackers use custom flashing tools, privilege escalation exploits, and even supply chain attacks to get their payload into the firmware. And once they do, they become ghosts in the machine. They can spy on you before the OS loads, disable security controls silently, or even brick your entire system on command. The average user doesn't check firmware integrity. Most companies don't monitor BIOS changes. That's why these attacks are so dangerous. They're nearly undetectable and often irreversible. Even forensic experts sometimes fail to notice them. And because they operate at the firmware level, these implants can even reinfect clean systems automatically during boot, like a cursed resurrection loop. Defending against them requires firmware integrity tools like ChipSec, strict secure boot enforcement, hardware level attestation, and a paranoid mindset. Some modern CPUs include trusted platform modules and hardware root of trust to fight back. But even those can be bypassed if the attacker gets in early enough. And let's not forget the firmware in SSDs, network cards, even GPUs. All potential entry points, all often overlooked. Because once someone plants malware in your BIOS, they don't just hack your computer. They own your foundation. They write the rules. They watch from beneath. And if you're not looking down there, they'll stay forever. So next time your system reboot, ask yourself, is it really booting from a clean slate? Or is something darker waking up first? So the next time you press that power button, remember, not all threats live inside your OS. Some crawl underneath it, waiting, watching, rewriting the rules from the shadows. This is the level where only the most advanced hackers dare to play. If this opened your eyes to a deeper layer of cyber warfare, then don't stop here. Like the video, share it with fellow tech warriors, and smash that subscribe button, because we're diving even deeper into the dark corners of hacking. Comment below if you think your BIOS is still clean, or if you're already too late. See you in the next one.